G'day guys, Carly from Offbeat Art. How you going? How's your day been? How's your night been? Um, quick g'day. And now I'll get down to what we're going to do today. Alrighty. out of the way all right thought I'd do a bloom um, I know I said in my last video that I wasn't gonna but um, daughter daughter decided on a bloom and uh, she wants pinks oh, better pull my hair back uh, she wants pinks golds and white so I hunted up a couple of pink and uh, I really didn't want to put white in and of itself in it. Um, mainly because I'm using a white cell activator. So I've got a new paint here from Amsterdam uh, that's a purple pearl, but it's actually white. I think it's purple pearl pearl violet sorry but that's what color it is but this is it here and it uh, goes like that so I thought since I already had some of it mixed up I would use it instead of white and I'm just hoping uh, it will give a nice effect. But um, I want to do a trial run of these colours and just see if they worked or maybe I might have to take one out or change one out or add something else or whatever the case may be. So this one is Deco Art um, Celebration Pink, I believe. Yes, Celebration Pink from Deco Art, and uh, it's quite pretty. Um, the next one is Deco Art Neon Pink, and it is neon. Let me tell you, people, it is well, to be honest, bloody beautiful. It really is. My, I don't think it shows up on my camera though. For some reason, the camera changes colours. So, but it is a lovely colour, this paint. It really is. It's really vibrant. Really just, yeah. Um, my other colour is my all time favourite <gasps> Deco Art 24 Karat Gold. This paint, there, there's just, there's no equal to it. There really isn't. Um, I've used other golds, and yeah, they, they don't compare to this. They really don't. It's beautiful. And last but not least is Deco Art Pink Tourmaline which happens to be a oh, metallic metallic pink tourmaline so yeah so they're the four five one two three four five yes they're the five it has a yeah, it has a bit of a glitter to it. So we'll see. I might have to, I might have to take one out because uh, she did mention like dark light, white and gold. So yeah, we'll see. Anyway, so my pillow paint is as usual, just an ordinary low sheen house paint for walls, water-based acrylic. 
um, I use Taubman's and I get it cheap at the moment. It's only uh, it's about 64 bucks for six liter. So it's, uh, it's quite cheap. And um, all my paints are mixed with, I use a, no, sorry, not Taubman's, British paints um, for my base. And I use uh, Taubman's for, what was it, British paints? I think the first one might have been Taubman's. I think the second one I got was British paints. British paints are uh, low sheen for walls, neutral. And, and it's got to be neutral for your pouring medium because otherwise the white one will actually change the color of your paint because it's already tinted white. Um, so you've got to take your neutral and because then you're adding your own color to it. Um, and Joe Sonia's pouring medium and a bit of polycrylic and I mix them uh, two to one so two paint one Joe Sonia's and one polycrylic mix it all up and then I then mix my paints then with that pouring medium three to one so these are all three to one um, and my CA is um, just titanium white Amsterdam, uh, where is it, down here, titanium white, um, and I use 5 mils to 20 mil Floetrol, and that's all it is, it's just Floetrol and Amsterdam titanium white, that's it, <coughs> excuse me, alrighty, so let's get started, what is that? And a cup of paint, and I don't even know what it is. I usually write on my cups. Alrighty. So I'll put my pillow paint down, and I'm thinking, I'm thinking for this one, I might do two balloons. Should I do them like that? Offset them on the diagonal, or in the center. I'll do them in the center first, I think, and see how that goes. And if I I don't get the result and I end up either keeping the colors and adding another or pulling a color out to add something else, um, then I might do them on the on the uh, diagonal. I love these canvases, but because they're a rectangle, uh, sometimes they can be sort of painful to work with, more so than a, like a square or a circle. A square you can, uh, like when you're tilting, you can control it more with your tilt, whereas with the rectangle, yeah, it, uh, you tend to lose it off your sides and stuff when you're going for your corners because your sides are so much longer. Alrighty, pillow paint's down. I've only got a little left in that. Thankfully I've got my other bottle there for a refill. Now, what should I do first? What order? I didn't even think about order. Um, 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 I might go pink tourmaline first and then uh, maybe a bit of the I keep forgetting the darn name of that paint pearl violet I keep thinking it's purple pearl pearl violet then I might go the pearl violet then I'll go the neon uh, yeah I don't know we'll see I might put one on one and some on the other and some not on the other side, I don't know. I'll just plonk it all down and see how I go, I think. That's usually what tends to work for me. So how you all been anyway? Me? I've been great. And I've got shadow on that. Um, yeah, 
been good. Good day today, Sunday. It's uh, Sunday here in Brisbane, Queensland. It uh, was a bit warm, but um, my, my lawn finally got mowed the other day. It's uh, It had been close on two months. I've been chasing my old mower man since the 2nd of February to mow my lawn. And for a week and a half, he kept saying he'd turn, he was going to come. He, I'm coming, I'm coming. And he, one day he, he texts me and he's like, he, he'd say in a text message, I'll be there Monday. And then Monday he'd come and go and he'd send me a text that evening and he said, got held up today, I'll be there tomorrow. Yeah, next day tomorrow would come and go. And as you all know, tomorrow never comes. Um, would come and go and he wouldn't turn up and he did that for a week and a half. And then we got storms, which lasted for like, well, pretty well a month on and off, but because we got a week of full on torrential rain, um, everything flooded badly. So then when a few days it dried up, like it, for a few days we had sun, then we got more rain. So it would just get to the point where it's like, yep, he can come and bam, it would start raining again because he would, he'd said you know oh yeah i'll come tomorrow and then next thing i know get up next morning it's been raining and i'm just like you're kidding me in the end it turned out he just yeah for some unknown reason didn't want to do it and so i thought i'm through dicking around with you and uh yeah so i ditched him and got a new guy and uh, i'm very happy with him um, he came, mowed it, like it was taller than me, and I'm five foot. So uh, I've got a, um, a, what do you call them? Um, um, geez, retaining wall out the back here, and on top of it, it's all weed, and out there it was taller than me. So. The stuff on the actual lawn was only about knee height, but um, I was highly disgusted. I put in a big complaint about him anyway. Uh, new guy seems good, done a great job, must admit. And uh, he's going to be back in three weeks, which is good. So we'll see. How's everyone going with their pets? I bet their pets are loving it. Eh? Having his all home. Be like Christmas for them. I know my guys are enjoying it. I had, uh, had Jupiter abusing me last night when I was trying to do a video, actually. And she yells at me when she wants me to come. When I should be where she thinks I should be and I'm not. And, uh, as it turned out, I thought it was on camera, but it, the camera had beeped at me, and I'm like, nah, you you still got battery, and I plugged it straight in, and it turns out it wasn't the battery, it was the darn memory card, and it was full, because I put a 34 gig in it, um, and the darn thing was full, and it cut out, so all the talking and everything i done, after it beeped at me, which was like, maybe five minutes into it it was all for nothing so consequently I did not upload that video it went in the trash bin alright let's see if we're on a winner I don't know I'm not uh, I'm really not feeling that uh, pink terminal in Tourmaloin. Yeah, tournament. Tournament. Tournaloin. But anyway, here we go.
shouldn't have done that. But anyway, let me hang on. I didn't realise, I thought that was Biddle um, cell activator and it wasn't. And I want them to actually be joined. Oh, it's looking pretty so far. This has changed my mind. I didn't like it when it was in a puddle. I'm actually not minding it now. What do you guys reckon? That gold, my god, I still cannot get over that gold, y'all. It is just like, look at what it has gone and done there. I don't know if you can see it too well. It is just, wow, like right here on there like see how it's gone all over everything and when I stretch that out it is just gonna stretch so much but look it's even done it down in um where are we here there's some neon pink here and yeah it's, it's just shimmed over there. everything is just it was a bit balking a bit at five bucks a bottle you know, because as you know, they're like itty bitty bottles. Like, look, oh, look at that. It's um, it's a fraction longer. Well, the actual bottle with the paint is the length of my index finger. It's only done in 59 mil, for God's sake. But um, yeah, well worth the 55 bucks, the five bucks. I was just gonna go like that, but I don't know. I think I might just stretch them. Yeah, I think I'll stretch them. I don't think I'm gonna squiggle it. I'll just stretch it. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna go um, that corner first. I'm gonna go down here. Come back to here. I've actually posted a few pics on Facebook and um, in one the lady asked me what the paint was and I told her and she says dumbfounded like do you really use house paint I'm like yeah, yeah. and uh, I don't think she really believed me to be honest so I ended up, I, I went in the shed because I was going to um, actually bring the tins out and put them um, on the video next time I done a video. And I went into the shed and I grabbed them and I started waddling out <laughs> into the other room with them and... Um, Then it hit me, I'm like, you dodo head. Why don't you just take a photo? So, I took a photo and put it up. And uh, she hasn't commented since. Uh, I don't know. I think she, maybe she might have been a bit in, like, wow, really, but not in a good way. You know, like in uh, shock, surprise, or can't sort of put their head around it that the fact that you're using like house paint in a in an acrylic painting in an acrylic pour let's give me a second to look at this guys I'm trying to yeah I think I'll leave it Maybe I'll take it down that way just a fraction. So it's not so wispy just here. Fingers are sticking to this height. 
is enough paint. There we go. What do you guys think? I think it's beautiful. I don't really know about this section though. But I'm not going to mess with it. Because I do like it, I must admit. Um, I'm thinking maybe, though, I'll minus that colour out of it. And uh, I think that. Um, Pearl Violet was a bit of a waste. So, can't really see it, to be honest. Hasn't uh, come up anywhere. Not that I can see, anyway. Can't see any uh, shimmer or pearly colouring or purple colouring in it. But yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you very, very much for joining me. And if you haven't already, and you like it, please hit the like button. Um, if you want to see more of this, and others in the future, different styles and stuff, please subscribe. And don't forget to hit your notification bell twice. And don't forget, when you're doing a pour, run your finger, or your paddle pop stick, or your palette knife. Um, underneath your painting to get any drips because otherwise it will pull your whole paint paint well a good whack of your paint off when you come back out to check it when it's drying half of it will be laying in a puddle on the floor so it will but anyway thank you guys for joining me so very very much let me just do clean my hair uh, really appreciate it. Please stay safe uh, in the times that we're in. And um, until I see you again, take care. Bye.